For this exercise, you're going to bend both your knees and put your feet flat on the floor, about hip width apart. We're trying to target your low abdominal muscles. So to do this, I like to tell people to pretend that there's a grape under their low back. You're going to use your low abdominal muscles to contract that and try to squish your back flat to the table. You will feel your pelvis tilt back a little bit. You're going to hold this position for three to five seconds and then slowly relax and repeat the rep. For this exercise, you're going to perform the posterior pelvic tilt that we learned in the last video. You're going to squish your back flat onto the table. I like to tell people to put their hands on their hip bones so that you can monitor the motion that you're having in this. With the marching, you're going to be lifting one foot at a time. We'll start with this one. Very slowly off of the table, keeping that pelvic tilt, trying to eliminate any motion that you'll feel on your hip bones. Especially when you switch feet, that's where most of the motion is going to try to happen. So eliminate that the best that you can. Keep this motion slow and controlled and keep your pelvic tilt engaged the whole time. For this exercise, you're going to be starting on your hands and your knees. You want your knees to be right under your hips and your hands to be right under your shoulders. It's really important to keep a tight core. I like to tell people to pretend that you have a bowl of cereal on your low back. It tries to just help you from eliminate that motion in your pelvis. So keeping that bowl here, you're going to then extend one leg and the opposite arm nice and slow with very little motion. You'll come back to center, again very controlled, and then you'll switch sides. Be really careful not to let much motion come from the back here.